Good morning, everybody. Pastor Stitch, Narrow Path Christian Church, BC, Bay City, Michigan. Welcome to the Biker Devotional. So this morning as I'm setting here, uh, first of all, I shut my alarm off. I never do that. Don't know what happened. Shut my alarm off, rolled over and looked at the clock and said, oh no. And yet, I did what I needed to do this morning to be in front of God first. Yes, it gets really difficult, creates problems the rest of the day if my timing is off. I've got to deal with stuff now. But here's the thing. If I didn't take my time with God, all that stuff would still be there and I'd have the distraction and the danger of not being present with God. I know I've done it so many times in my life. Every one of my readings today had to do with drawing close to God and trusting Him for the things I need. And then this morning in Proverbs chapter 12, I read in verse 24, the diligent hand will rule, but, the, but laziness will lead to forced labor. And I looked that up to read it a little bit deeper. Basically what it means is a person who works hard will find that they have power in their lives. But a lazy person, according to this, is going to have a major burden on their life. Forced labor, a major burden, the way the word translates out. So what's that mean? Well, it means when you do the right things for the right reasons, you'll find that you have the power of God working in you. It means you have your focus on God first. If you do that, you'll find you have the power of God on you and in you and through you. He'll provide what he needs. Jehovah Jireh means the God who provides. He'll provide what you need to accomplish the tasks that are set in front of you. But if you're lazy, all you're going to have is the burdens and the struggles. I could have got up this morning, got myself running, I would have been able to get everything done, been to work on time, do all the things I needed to do. But the burdens of life would have overwhelmed me. Today, I had still had the same burdens I would have had that had I not gone to God. But I have set myself up to trust in God first. I'm not saying I'm going to be perfect at it. I am saying I'm setting myself up. I definitely was diligent in seeking God first today. How about you? I love y'all. I hope you have a great day. God bless.